Well, this chinchilla is having stones stuck in the penis, unfortunately. So, when I have to um, place a catheter in his penis, and I'm going to retro flush the stones into the bladder and retrieve it from the bladder. So I want to proceed placing a, 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 a catheter in his penis, going into the urethra. Okay, we place the catheter. We were able to flush the uh, stones into the bladder. So uh, now we're just having urine coming out. Uh, so now I want to open the bladder and retrieve the stones. Okay, now we're opening the abdomen. This chinchilla had surgery before. Now, unfortunately, the owner um, ran out of the special diet and the chinchilla formed stones immediately. Okay, we're able to um, express the bladder out. Uh, it's having several adhesions because, as I say, uh, this chinchilla has had surgery before. Um, probably we have some stones still causing some blockage because it's, you know, the, 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 this should be empty by now because of the catheter. But so now I want to go and open the bladder and flush everything out. Okay, this is the end result. You know, the incision is completely closed now. The penis is exposed. You know, it's still under anesthesia, so so the retractor muscles are completely relaxed. Now we need to get the chinchilla uh, dry as soon as possible. You know, chinchillas technically cannot get wet, uh, but this is the end result. We will treat the stones.